good morning students today we will do the back side exercise from chapter 8 introduction to python you have to open page number 103 fill in the blanks dash refers to the grammatical rules to be followed while writing a program in any language answer is syntax python was created by dash gedo van rosam dash menu is generally used to edit the file in use answer edit in the interactive mode of python the instructions are executed dash giving the output answer is line by line a dash is a named memory location that stores the data answer variable python dash cannot be used as a variable name answer keyword now true or false to evaluate an arithmetic expression it is not necessary to use print function answer is true a variable name can consist of alphabet digit and underscore answer is true a script is a program that you type in python answer is true in python only one type of data can be stored in memory answer is false the print function is used to accept the value of a variable from the user answer is false we use input function the string values cannot be multiplied together answer is true when we use comma operator as the separator among the values the values are displayed with a space between them answer is true application application based questions kritika's computer teacher has given her an assignment to display the names of the fruits separated with a tab space in python which separator should she use with the print function answer is kritika should use backslash or t separator with the print function uska means tab space dene ke liye wo function use karna hai theek hai aman aman is working on his mathematics project he has to perform some cube calculations which mode of python programming should he use for doing them aman should use interactive mode now multiple choice question which of the following data types is not supported in python option c list when a new value is stored in a variable its previous value gets answer is overwritten values to variables are assigned using the dash operator answer is option c assignment the data type for 12.4 should be answer is float to give tag space while printing the statement you should use dash option a backslash t the area where you type the code is called answer is option c script area print quotation mark 10 plus quotation mark 20 will give the output answer is option b 1020 1020 now answer the following questions write any four features of python language answer is python is an easy to learn general purpose programming language second it has a simple syntax third one python is a case sensitive language fourth one it is an interpreted language what is a variable discuss the rule for naming the variables a variable is a reserved memory location that stores and manipulates data the rule for valid identifier variable name are first one a variable name must start with an alphabet capital or small or an underscore second a variable name can consist of alphabet digits and underscore 
no other character is allowed third one a python keyword cannot be used as a variable name now explain the different working modes of python python works in two modes interactive mode and script mode in the interactive mode of python the instructions are executed line by line giving the output in this mode the commands are typed next to the python command prompt interactive mode is preferred for small programs where only a few commands are to be executed whereas for writing lengthy programs in python script mode is used using this mode we can create and edit python programs in this mode we can save our time save our file so that it can be used later the complete script is written in an editor such as notepad in windows i am repeating the answer once again python works in two modes interactive mode and script mode in the interactive mode of python the instructions are executed line by line giving the output in this mode the commands are typed next to the python command prompt interactive mode is preferred for small programs where only a few commands are to be executed whereas for writing lengthy programs in python script mode is used using this mode we can create and edit python program in this mode we can save our file so that it can be used for later the complete script is written in an editor such as a notepad in windows what are data types explain any two data types in python A data type represents the type of data stored in a variable. Python has various standard data types based on the type of value. Some examples of data types used in Python are integer, float, string, int, float, str. Integer int represents the integral numbers, numbers without any fractional part. There are three types of integers in Python: int, 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 long int, and bool, boolean. Now float. Float represents floating point values, numbers with a fractional part. The fractional part of a floating point number may be zero as well. Examples: three point one four, minus forty eight point six, eighteen point zero, etc. what is the use of print function discuss all the separators used with the print function the print function is used to display the output of any command on the screen it can also be used to print the specified messages the separators used with print function are using comma operator when you use comma operator as the separator among the values the values are displayed with a space between them using backslash t tab space when you use the tab space escape sequence as the separator among the values the values are displayed with a tab space between them using backslash n new line character A new line character in Python is used to end a line and start a new line. What is an interpreter? How is it different from a compiler? Interpreter is a language processor. When you type a command next to the Python prompt and press the enter key, the interpreter enter key, the interpreter converts the command into machine language. after processing the interpreter again convert the machine code into human readable form output whereas a compiler is a language processor that convert the program written in high level language into machine language and vice and vice versa in one single step i am repeating the answer once again interpreter is a language processor when you type a command next to the python prompt and press the enter key the interpreter converts the command into machine language after processing the interpreter 
again converts the machine code into human readable form output whereas a compiler is a language processor that converts a program written in high level language into machine language and vice versa in one st single step